So for every calculation that you do in science, we want you to follow this, this process and this method. Don't take shortcuts, follow this step-by-step -step method and you'll get full marks. So the first thing we want you to do is take a look at the question and pick out the numbers that are mentioned in the question. So it says a car travels 20 meters in two seconds. What is the average speed of the car? So the first thing to do is write down your data list. So this is all the information that you know, first of all, from the question. So we know a car travels 20 meters. So the distance the car travels is 20 meters. The second thing we know is that it takes two seconds to travel that distance. So the time it takes to travel 20 meters is two seconds. And then the, the third thing that we don't know yet is what is the average speed? So speed, we don't know. But there is our data list and we're gonna use that information to help to answer the question. So in, in science, when you get a question like this, it will usually be worth three marks. So I'm gonna show you how you get all three marks for this question. Okay, so the first mark is simply for writing down the correct equation. So the equation for this is average speed equals distance divided by time. And that would get you one mark just for writing the equation. The second mark is for substituting values into the equation. So what do we mean by substituting values in? Well, just the information that we have here in our data list, putting that information into the equation. So average speed So our distance we know is 20 meters and our time we know is two seconds. That's your second mark. And then the final mark is for actually doing the calculation. And you can use a calculator for all your questions in science. So 20 divided by two is equal to 10 meters per second. So you must make sure that you put your units in order to get the third mark.